Hey guys, for this video, we're going to take a look at this VaBiz HD projector. They were nice enough to send me this item for free so I can make a video showing it to you. We're going to unpack this thing, take a look at the projector itself and what accessories come with it. Then we'll get it all hooked up, take a look at it, and talk about some more of the specifics with this projector. Now this one actually comes with its own screen in this bag has a little check mark next to the 100 inch so we'll check that out now we get this case it's a nice padded case actually you got a handle up top for carrying it making it a little more portable we also have a pocket in the back we have a side zipper pouch for some of our accessories we have a cord for that screen that's included we also have a variety of these peel and stick hooks that are also going to be used with that screen we have the power cord a little cleaning cloth we have the remote control the power button the forward and back navigational buttons menu button volume buttons needs two AAA batteries not included also in the side pouch we get the owner's manual and a quick start guide now let's get to what you came for. This guy unzipped and bam. There's our projector. We'll take a little tour around the projector here. We got the lens cover right up front. We got our lever to adjust the focus there. This little box here is the receiver for the remote control signal. Just a plain panel on this side. We have the presumably power button on top there. We have our keystone knob here. That's to adjust the uh, angle of the picture. Our power cord plugs in there. We have two HDMI ports. You'll be able to plug in a PlayStation, an Xbox, a DVD player, um, a Fire Stick, a Roku box, anything. That's HDMI to be able to plug in there. We have two USB ports, so a flash drive or external hard drive if you have videos on there. We have an audio output jack. We have another receiver, IR for the remote. And we can also plug into a computer with the port on the end there. Another plain panel on that side just for some airflow. As we look at the bottom panel here, you see these four holes there are threaded, so you can put a mount if you wanted to mount it to some kind of like a tripod or ceiling mount this upside down, you could do that. Notice this here says press, and watch what happens when we press. Bam! So that is to adjust the pitch of our projector when we are lining it up with our screen. Really cool, different way of doing it that I haven't seen from other projectors. But I like that. Let's get it hooked up, see how it works, talk about some of the features. You can see we have the projector all set up. I'm going to show you a couple of clips recording the screen with my camera. In the first clip, I'm just mirroring my phone screen. I have an Android phone, a Samsung. It was super easy to connect. Pull down the drop down menu, click the smart things bar. The projector was one of the options. Click connect, bam. It was that simple to get this up and going, and this is just a video on the exhaust on my truck that I did a while back and streaming, or mirroring, sorry, from my phone. So the projector is full HD, 1080p. It has a 15,000 to 1 contrast ratio. It supports a screen size of up to 300 inches, which is huge. It does connect to your Wi-Fi. Obviously, you can see you can connect it to an Android phone. You can also connect it to an iPhone. The projector also has Bluetooth, so you could connect it to a Bluetooth speaker. Internally, the projector has a 10-watt stereo speaker. Now, for this second clip, it is gameplay from an Xbox One playing the Wreckfest game. thought it would be something with high motion and a lot going on so that you could see... Um, how it handles that type of situation. So there it is guys, the Vabiz HD projector. I'm going to leave you with another minute or so of gameplay footage for you to check out. Thanks for watching.